Hi guys. Good evening. How are you? Hi teacher. Hi. Hoy sí te sirve el micrófono, ¿verdad? Hoy sí, teacher. Eso. Así tiene que ser, hay que revisar antes de. Es que ayer, no, es que ayer no sé qué pasó con el internet o algo, pero mm -hmm. no me dejaba. Y ustedes empezaron a hablar y ya no, ya no escuché. No escuchaba, ok. Pero It's hoy right. sí. Excellent, we are ready. Great. Now, uh, today's topic is going to be basically, just let me verify some information here. It's going to be related to adverbs of or the sequence adverbs, correct? Correct. So, you have an activity for today, if I'm not mistaken. You need to talk about an event, okay, using the adverse of frequency. I mean, sequence. Sequency adverbs. Just let me open up everything here. And I'm going to start with the most talkative student in the classroom, which is, da -da -da, Carlos. Okay, let's listen to Carlos. All right, Carlos, go ahead and tell us about the event using the sequency adverbs. Teacher, can, can I pass for now? Ah, <laughs> uh, come on. <laughs> I will bet because uh, today was a, a difficult day for me mm -hmm. and I don't have time for do the activity. Ah, come on, Carlos, come on. <laughs> Solo Sorry. porque te creo. Yes. Okay. Um, Vicente, go ahead. Vicente, are you here? Sorry, I was mute. <laughs> I ah, was okay. talking in, in the microphone. You. Sorry. It's okay. Um, first of all, um, in my job, we make two excursions per okay. year. Mm -hmm. And uh, last month, we made one. Uh, where, where do you go? We went to a, a play who co had that calls El Refugio. It's in Chalatenango. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. We went uh, uh, in a big bus mm -hmm. because we were about um, about more than fifty person people. People, right? <clears throat> mm -hmm. We we left for my job about uh, about 6 15 more or less a.m and we arrived there four hours after <laughs> it's mm -hmm. very far we arrived okay. at more or less at 10 a.m mm -hmm. uh, the, the place is uh, is a jungle but the majority of uh, trees there are pinos mm -hmm. pinos yeah pines um, mm -hmm. hmm? pines pinos uh, pines mm -hmm. okay uh, that place has only only one restaurant but uh we walk around the place and it's a jungle walking uh down and up because it also it has a, a a river and to to get together the river we have to walk about more than uh kilometers mm -hmm. from the from the place we arrive okay also has also has a um, um, several how do you say cabanas or or mini like mini houses uh, and 
inside has a Cabins. bed, bathrooms, uh, mm -hmm. stove, and ha hammocks, and hammocks. Uh -huh. The that li little houses or short houses are very nice, but mm -hmm. are several. Mm -hmm. We say there about uh, about. Uh, four hours because we left mm -hmm. um, about 2 p.m. from okay. there mm -hmm. to come back. Okay. Um, secondly, okay, we uh, we start to 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 come back uh, from that place and start raining during the way but it's uh it was very hard raining and okay. uh, the traffic was very difficult we spent we spent about more than four hours to come back certainly mm -hmm. uh, thirdly when we arrived to the capital the traffic was very difficult because the the rain and the, our bus uh, mm -hmm. it was big and so difficult to to move uh, inside the city or or to move uh, in the on the street mm -hmm. okay um after that we we find a lot with uh, with the traffic and we arrive to our job about about 10 uh, no 7 p.m. Mm -hmm. it was terrific uh, during the the wake um later we have to to come back to our houses uh because the bus um carry us to the job so uh we have to we have to 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 leave to our houses and um and finally <laughs> we arrive to our houses but was terrific during the the um, how do you say camino de regreso the, during the the come back way the way back the way back was terrific because the the rain mm -hmm. and uh, but in that place it, it very nice to walk around and to to see the 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 nature the, the nature, right? Uh huh. And uh, a lot of uh, pine trees, and the winds is very f fresh, okay. and it's very nice there. But the the translate or the move is very very difficult. Okay. So that's it. That's thank, it. Thank you. Have you ever have you ever gone to have you gone to the Green Hill? Cerro uh, Verde? No, I haven't. Okay. Maybe, maybe that's someday. A that's a nice place, actually. A ah, nice okay. place where you can have fun with your family members. And there are uh -huh. different places where you can go ahead and buy uh, food, uh, typical dishes, etc. Stay there. Stay there. Yeah, the fresh is amazing. Mm -hmm. I mean, the air is so fresh. The weather. Ah, yeah. It's amazing. And the view, actually, you can see the volcano, Isalco's volcano from that place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very nice there. Yeah, I really love it, actually. We went like three weeks ago with my father-in-law and mother-in-law, and yeah. we stayed there the almost the, the complete day. And we didn't want to come back 
However, there was a big storm and that's the reason why we decided to leave that place earlier. Have you stayed at the new hotel? No, actually, uh, my uh, my sister-in-law went to one of those places, which is Casa Cristal, I think. Yeah, right. I have never gone to that place. I would like to. And uh, But they went at night, as far as I remember. Okay. And they left that place around 10 p.m. Yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah. That would be nice, uh, enjoying that fresh air. Fresh let's, air. Let's the listen nature. to and the nature. Thank yeah. you, Vicente, and applause. Okay. Great job. Thank okay. you very much. Let's listen to Oscar. Okay, Oscar, go ahead. Luis, Edgar, and Evelyn, turn your cameras on. Well, Evelyn says, good night, teacher. I'm going to listen to the class. Okay. Thank you, Evelyn. Anna, Sonia says, good evening, teacher. I have connected and I will be listening. But I'm working too. Thank you, Anna. Okay, uh, let's listen to Oscar. Oscar, go ahead, please. Remember that you need, to, you need to put in practice the sequency adverbs most of the times you are going to find them as sequence adverbs. Sometimes you will find them as adverbs of sequence, but that's the same thing. Okay, Oscar, thank you. Well, uh, I'm sorry, but I I come uh, later. Um, late. Late, uh, but um, uh, can I uh, describe what I do, what I do in, in, in the day. Okay, what you did during the day, that's great. Yes, that can be an event. If you have an event, go ahead and do so. Well, thanks. Um, well, um, this day, um, I wake up. Uh, first, uh, the ball. First, first, I wake. First, uh -huh. I, I wake up. Uh, mm, I woke up. The past awake woke. Oh, wake wake up. Woke up. Woke up um, at um, five o'clock. Um, then I wash me. Um, I to, took a shower. I took a shower. Thanks. I took a shower. Uh, <laughs> no me la veo. I took a shower. Sí, sí, sí. Correcto. Como que fuera carro. Uh -huh. I took, I a, took shower. a shower. Um, I took a shower and uh, thoroughly I take uh, my breakfast and took, took my, my breakfast and then I, I prepare to, to go to my job and I um, I llegué. I arrived. Arrived. I arrived. Thanks. I arrived um, at uh, fifteen uh, after ten. Um, um, then I I come back to my home and. And uh, 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 continue uh, working in in my house. Mm -hmm. I... <laughs> okay. And later, finally, okay. finally, um, I I go to to. Colonia Los Almendros um, in, in a funeral and then I, well, actually I recite uh, a discourse. Okay. I'm receiving discourse. Okay. Thank you. Edgar, go ahead, please. 
what's your event? And I want you to use the sequence adverbs. Uh, well, I, I'm gonna try to tell you one event that happened to me. I, when I started the, the regimen of deception. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Well, first of all, it happened uh, one day we plan to go to the uh, Ilopango Lake, mm -hmm. but uh, two friends of mine and me, mm -hmm. we are three. We were and three. We were three. And secondly, we plan uh, Friday, and we went to the Lupango Lake and Sunday. And well, um, secondly, as I mentioned before, we went to the lake uh, because uh, in that place live a other friend that is scared. Um well everything was so good because we enjoyed an environment but it happened not in the inside of the uh water park. Mm -hmm. It's out. It was out in okay. Uh Everything was good uh, until the middle of the day at noon, mm -hmm. um, because after that uh, we got the lunch, we started to drink uh, some beer, mm -hmm. and one of our friends started to make a, a guns sign oh yeah mm -hmm. and thirdly happened the, the, the I would say peor the wrong things the worst thing. the worst thing things worse the worst things because uh, the guns uh, saw this uh, sign the gunsers uh huh uh huh and then uh, they tell the our friend, the girl that she lives there in that place, that if we don't um, Live. get away, mm -hmm. yeah, get away, but the play they are gonna kill us. They will kill the okay. Yeah, and. Thirdly, uh, we have to uh, took our uh, things, uh, got dressed, and we uh, she decided to uh, call a, a Uber, and, and later uh, we took the the taxi and. And finally, it happened in that day. It was a awful experience. An awful experience. Moment. Okay. Yeah. All right. The good thing is that nothing uh, bad happened to you. And yeah. the, my best advice for you will be not to invite that friend anymore. The yeah. one who was making signals. Because yeah. it's, it's because... something that you, I mean, you don't need to do. And it's something that you don't need to talk about. Right. Yes, yeah, because he you can he get in trouble. Yeah, and no because... weapons. No weapons. No, just... no beers no we... anymore. No, no beers. No weapons. <laughs> okay. Unfortunately, uh -huh. unfortunately, uh, they advise first. Okay. Unfortunately, they they advise first to um our friends. Mm -hmm. He not uh, were in that way 
other thing what's happened. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Now, uh, let's listen to Sarai Trejos. Sarai Trejos? You're mute, I think, or... Uh, no. Okay, I can hear you. Now? Yes. Well, the first about awful experience, right? Yeah. Mm, I never had, like, a real awful experience. Mm. So, I don't have, like, a really good history. Mm -hmm. um, but Brihan was um, when I was studying study at college we had a group uh, no a teamwork so it was this classmate that we are sitting in uh, the work the part of the homework and she do it but uh, the reality was that um, uh, another another student now of their career do their homework. So this was my whole experience. At the end, um, we verify because was this similar. We were similar in the homeworks. And we and we needed to do it again because if we not like re re rewire, I think, and we can uh, sell the homework. That's Is it. that it? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Let's listen to Luis Ernesto. Okay, good night, teacher. Uh, good I evening. try to I try to to explain about the experience and in the past. For example, uh, my family had a tradition in Christmas, and the last year, and my family and decorate the Christmas tree in the first. In the first of the month on December, and eating uh, turkey, tamales, and then visited the swimming pool. And then I, with my family, uh, celebrate and the finally years. Only that teach. Really? Remember that you need to use the sequency adverbs. First, second, then, after that, later. All right? Okay. Okay. Ana Sonia, thank you. You are mute. Ah, creo que está en el trabajo todavía. Según lo que dijo. Yes, I am working, but uh, in this moment uh, I can. You can um, practice, okay. Okay. I'm not fluent as I heard to Vicente like mm -hmm. that, <laughs> but I will try. It's okay. All right. uh, I'm. Thank you very I'm much. going to talk about my my day today. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Um, as usually, I got up at the four a.m. A.M. Um, looked my um, then I looked my for my clothes and my shoes and my earrings and whatever. And to later, look beautiful. Uh, yes. <laughs> yeah. Later I I prepare the um, ah take a bath a bathroom uh, take a shower excuse me and I brush my teeth. And when I uh, then I, I got dressed, hmm? 
Go dress. I get dressed. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Go dress and then uh, and after I prepare the the breakfast for my husband and me. And finally, I left uh, to my work, and I and I arrive and I arrive for more or less uh, four forty five. Uh, how can I say? Cuatro y cuarenta y cinco a.m. Four forty five. Ah, okay. Four forty five a.m. And then I, I um, after I have a, I, I had a meeting with my directors for more or less one hour. And later I uh, down to my to the dinner in the company. No dinner. Uh, Breakfast um, meeting. No. Lunch. Then the place. The place they went in. Yeah. I I I went to the take my 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 breakfast, but in the the place is a uh, comedor. I forgot dining room. Dining room, uh, uh, because the dining room is down in in something like that. The first uh, piece. Of? The first, first floor. floor. Okay. Uh huh. Um. But for every day, uh, for uh, for all day. I have had very hard <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, because I'm closing in accounting closing closing, oh, closing mm -hmm. months. Um, in this yes. moment, I work in two. Oh, but okay. finally, I got at the the objective that the we I have for this day. <laughs> uh, okay, great! Congratulations. Let me ask you something. Uh, since you work in the accounting department, don't you have the, the chance to take advantage of the time at the beginning of the month in order to get everything ready? Or do you have like, a, do you need to get ready everything at the end of the month? How do you do so? Do you plan ahead or do you start like preparing everything at the end or at the middle of the month? How do you? No, I mean, uh, for all I'm, the months, I'm curious. We're working for for to get the information, uh, update, okay. update every day. But uh, okay. uh, finally, on the months, uh, we always ha uh, had a, a a lot of transactions or or activities mm. to closing because uh, in my work uh, I am searched. Uh, in the um, general man uh, general manager uh, for five companies ah. yeah because uh, uh in this in this um, company has a um, is a laboratory veterina ah, okay. veterinary veterinary uh, laboratory and then, uh, uh, has a, a companies in Guatemala he visto in ah. Panama like in partnerships Dominicana. Yes, and in, uh, in El Salvador there are two companies. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's very difficult to organize everything. Yeah, it's difficult because uh, I I feel that uh, I working uh, all day a lot of and I don't feel that it's like uh, you never finish. Finish. <laughs> uh, I can imagine that. I know. Uh, I know how, time you, how hard that can be. What time you finish? Excuse at me? What time, you, at what time you finish or you leave from your job? Uh, usually, I go to my home uh, early 6 p.m. Uh, uh, Delay is when I go to the more or less 9 p.m. Oh, man. Uh-huh. And always, I uh, in, uh, also, also, eh, although, also, mm -hmm. You don't believe every day I am here uh, for a and a half a aim. Yeah, okay. that's very hard. I believe you. It's very hard because, <laughs> but uh, I arrive early because my husband uh, work in the Ateos in, uh -huh. in Centro Obrero uh, School mm -hmm. in the Ateos. Okay. And then, uh, he uh, give, give me a ride early because he mm -hmm. he goes to the the ateos. It's very difficult if if, if he don't lo, don't get up. He doesn't the, to pass the los chorros early. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh -huh. And then for this reason. 
very difficult. But it's very for me, really. <laughs> That's great. Okay. Uh, I really admire you, and I just want to say congratulations because yeah. all the hard, the hard job you do, you have to do a hard work every single day, and that is something um, that's not easy to to do. You need to make extra effort. You need to uh, take advantage or uh, put extra time of your personal time as well, because sometimes you need to bring some papers to your, your home as well. I know it's kind of yeah. Papers to put in order. Papers to put in order, okay. Yeah, it's yeah. difficult because- uh, in, That's uh, even in more the... difficult than being a teacher, I believe. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> teacher are very difficult too, because how <laughs> yeah. to break, prepare the class. <laughs> But, but we are learning. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Course. That's good. All right. Thank you for sharing. Okay. Now, let's listen to Carlos. Ya okay. tenemos tiempo, Carlos. Ya estás ready. Yes, I'm ready. Okay. You, sorry. You too, that, Carlos, uh, what department uh, do you work with? Are you a I'm, lawyer, uh, accountant, engineer? What, what do you do? I'm an engineer, but I am the director of my own company. Oh. oh my god. I have a uh, hundred workers here. Okay. And we we do a screen print. A screen? Print. Ah, okay. It's a okay. serigraphy. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. Great. Uh, yes. Uh we work uh, brands like Columbia, uh, <laughs> Under Armour, Adidas. Adidas, okay. Yes. That's awesome. Yes. All right. Is that like I'm a gonna, like a I'm factory? Gonna ask you a job. Sorry? Uh, is I, that like I a factory? Gonna... I don't have time I, I don't have time to live. Uh always I I I am here or I need to be at um um at atento listo or ready ready to the to any emergency. You know, and I am checking all the pros procedures here, and okay, I will, I will, um, I will talk about my day. Mm -hmm. Okay, first of all, today, um, uh, first of all, I that I explain, I work in a screen printing factory. The name of my company is Screen Printing Solutions. Uh, secondly, today was a difficult day because I was a lot of meeting. Mm -hmm. uh, thirdly, I resolved some problems with uh, with uh, today's shipping because uh, we are at the end of the month and uh, every week we need to dispatch some uh, containers. Uh, thirdly, uh, Oh, sorry. After that, I taken I taken some calls from my customers. Some of them uh, are really complicated, <laughs> you know. Do they uh, speak well. in Spanish or English? Uh, <laughs> both. Both. Uh, great, yes. great job. Chinese. Uh, <laughs> and applause for for, for that reason. I'm here because I need to more practice. You need uh, to practice uh, more. Yes, and. Uh, you know the the these people they understand what do you say but uh i need to speak better this is the reason that i that i'm here and you're and, doing a great job actually okay thank you and, and later uh, i answered some emails mm -hmm. and then i i pay some suppliers because you know we are we are at the end of the month, and the workers too. We need to do the the forms to pay them because this Friday uh, they will have a a payment day. And finally, I connect uh, to the English class and I did the homework in this moment. <laughs> okay, that's great. Yeah, yeah, you see another difficult day. I mean, yes. another difficult job that we have. Yes. All right. Thank you. Okay. Now, let's see. 
Uh, Edgar has participated. Yep. Uh, Luis Ernesto. Hi, teacher. <laughs> um, uh, you have already participated, right? Yes, yes, thank you. Okay, Evelyn. Hi, teacher. Hi. Okay, uh, in my case, uh, my day was very... Interesting. <laughs> also, <laughs> also okay. because I... Uh, I am a doctor and I work in, uh, in a clinic. Uh, today was a interesting day because mm -hmm. it was my first, my first, my first twice. No. How do you say my primera vez? Your first time? First time. Okay. First time. was my first sign that I put to the other uh, patient a uh, song to the I don't know how to say year in English. Iron. 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 Um, and some patient because the patient have to anemic. Anemia. Ah, uh, so that's that's like a uh, vitamin. Vitamin. Mm -hmm. Okay, some vitamin because um. Vitamin. Usually... Vitamina. No, what specific year? Because uh -huh. in in the other in the other time I put the vitamin or only the sueros. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to say sueros. But was interesting because I have I, I was nervous because it was my fire my first time, but I I did excellent <laughs> because the, the patient uh, told me that and uh, not uh, she didn't feel anything pain and she felt uh, better. And my day, all day was or oh, are so common or routine. And uh, in the morning, I I I get up uh, very early. After that, I took a shower and and then I go. I went to to my to my work and when I when I stayed in my work I I you know, I ate my 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 breakfast and after that I attend to to the patient or do the different thing. For example today put to I don't know how to say suero and I take a cytology and I put on nebulization. I don't know how to say nebulization. <laughs> and in in the put my fur my fur iron in in the in the venoso in the venoso. I have to say how to say the venoso. Um, it was was interesting. And all all thing was in the morning. And in the middle of the day, I I I don't know how to say calentar. But I put my my lunch in the I don't know how to say microondas. In the microwave. So okay, suero, y, microwave. suero es serum. Estás utilizando sí. vocabulario técnico que ahí sí me quebras. Porque para saber un es como que hable vocabulario técnico, eh, Carlos, de ingeniero. ¿No? Ahí sí me quiebran porque son bien técnicas las palabras. Pero suero se dice serum. Ok, bien. And I, I, ah, in the in the middle of the of the day, I, I ate my lunch. After that, I, I eat went. My lunch. The, uh -huh. I eat my lunch, and after that, I brush my teeth. And in the afternoon, exactly to two p.m., I tried to to do the the exercise of English, but I can't. I couldn't. I couldn't because my boss told me that I should I should went to the pharmacy and then I I went to the pharmacy and I attend to the other uh, cost customer yes to the other customer patient yeah. Say patient case. Mm -hmm. clientes patient your patient. customers are patient. patients paciente okay. patient 
okay the other operation um i i finished my work at 4 p.m after that i went to the gym i did exercise around two hours with their their minimum after that i i i try to to return to my I tried to <laughs> return to my home, but I couldn't because I I received to to the call and and the other patient um on site to my to my ward told me that need to uh, I don't know how to say visita domiciliar, but he need he needed that I went to the to the to the house the delivery uh, visit. Okay, delivery business, and then uh, I try to <laughs> or visit his house or her house. You can say that. Okay, they visit his house, and after that, I return to my house, and I I I don't know how to say me mujer <laughs> because okay, I got wet. I got wet because when when I return to my house it was raining. Uh, yeah, it's raining. And for oh, the okay. reason I have, I don't know how to say it, why, yeah, in my heart, in my towel. Head. Mm -hmm. Towel. I have a towel, towel on my head. Or I have okay. my head covered with a towel. 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 Okay. I'm not only that. Thank Be you. Be careful with the flu. Yeah. Thank you, Evelyn, <laughs> for sharing. Maria Jose, go ahead. Okay, what um, event are you going to talk about? I'm talk about for when I was visited. Um, y, bo, y volcano is is algo volcano. Is a is volcano, yeah. Is algo volcano. Sorry. Um, when I was a little, I visited the is volcano with my with my uncle. I remember going down the green hill and going up the volcano, the Isalco volcano. Mm -hmm. I have, I had, I have, I have never mm -hmm. climbed a volcano. Climbed. I usually climbed, sorry, climbed a volcano. I usually visited the mountain with Mount Mountain. Sorry, mountains. 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 With my with my family. Family, sorry. But never a volcano. Mm -hmm. That I remember that day that day was a great and I always remember that. Mm -hmm. Only that. Okay. Remember that you need to use the sequency adverbs first Not then true. later after that at the end finally okay okay thank you guys for participating let me go ahead and share my computer screen just give me some seconds i want to show you something really important okay once you can see it just let me know please Can you see my computer? Not yet. Oh yeah, right now it's ready. First, then. Yeah. Now, uh, let me go ahead and share the most common uh, frequency adverbs. So the first one you have here is first, correct? First. This is first. Then you have mm -hmm. next. Next. Okay. Then. Then. This one should be uh, after that. Because we have two next. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. This one is after. after that. After that. Uh. 
that. That. Okay. After that. Then finally. Finally. And uh Again. this this one shouldn't be first here. Okay. But those are delete. the most common ones. Yeah, we're going to delete it. First, next, after that, then, and finally. Okay, those are the sequence adverbs. Okay. However, besides the sequence adverbs, you can mix them. Okay, let me go ahead and show you some other ones. Encontré esta página por ahí. Que quise compartirlas, yo sé que no se, no se ve de bien clarito, ¿verdad? Traté de mejorar lo más que pude, pero me interesó más los frequency adverse que tenemos acá. Yeah. Por eso más que todo lo traje. Ok. First and next. If you, if you see, this is like uh, more complete. First, then, next. After, after, after that, after that before, before, before that, before that and finally. finally. Okay. Um, let's let's read this story. It says, first, Sam woke up at six o'clock. Then, uh, Sam got up. Then yeah. he ate breakfast. Or Sam got up. Uh, and then he ate breakfast. That, those are two options that you can use. Okay. Next, he went to work. Or Sam ate breakfast and next he went to work. After he ate breakfast. Or you can say, after he ate breakfast, Sam went to work. If you, yeah. if you realize we are following a sequence. After that... He went to work, or Sam made breakfast, and after that he went to work. Okay, before, before he went to work, or before he went to work, Sam ate breakfast. Before that, he ate breakfast. You can also use the other option. And finally, uh, Sam finished work, come home, and watch TV. Second option, finally he went to bed or he finally went to bed. So those are really important to put in practice, the sequence of adverbs or adverbs of, free, of sequence. Beside this, I would like to share the sequence words. This is something totally different. I don't want you to get confused. We have Sequency adverbs and sequency words. Carlos, can you please read the sequency words? Yes, teacher. When do we use them? Okay. Using sequency words is a key a skill for passing the IB a exam. IB exam. Mm -hmm. Knowing how to use each word correctly and effectively and effectively is crucial for making sure your easy, easy essay. essay is both readable and understand, understandable. Readable and understandable. Okay, sequency words. With sequency words, we have uh, to talk about at the beginning of our story or at the beginning of our writing and in the middle of the writing. Okay. In the beginning, you can use expressions like in the beginning, in the beginning. at the beginning, once upon a time. This is like the most common one to start mm -hmm. a, a story. You say once upon a time. Once upon a time. First, first of all, like the one I said, and first. Yeah. Okay. First. Sequency word. Uh, or sequency expressions, if you want to say that. If you say, once upon a time to start a story, people are going to take you seriously. Why? 
Because they are going to say, oh, this guy knows advanced expressions. If you say, in the beginning, all right, once upon a time, and you have expressions or sequencing words to use at the middle. You can say the next day, later that day, meanwhile, after a while, furthermore, and you have uh, the rest of the words, then, later, soon, next, and second. Okay. What I want you to do for tomorrow, I want you to talk about a child story. A story when you were a child. And okay. you, need, you need to mix the sequency adverbs with the sequency words. And what's going to be the purpose of this? The purpose will be to start sounding more advanced. Okay? More, I mean, you need to have a higher level of English. You are in intermediate one, you're going to move to intermediate two, and then you're going to move to the advanced level. What does it mean? It means that you need to use advanced expressions or vocabulary. Okay. Okay. So if you if you talk about something, let me go ahead and let me go ahead and start a story when I was a child. Okay. So I'm going to talk about the story of my best friend. Okay. Once upon a time, I met uh, my best friend. We were eight years old and we decided to be uh, the best friends ever. His name is uh, Walter. So at the beginning, that was kind of so complicated for both of us because he studied in the, in the morning and I studied in the afternoon. Sometimes when we had a time to play in the afternoon, we used to do it. Um, later, we became uh, good friends and we decided to attend a church, a Christian church, by the way. Um, later, we met one of our best friends, a female friend who used to study with us in the same school. After some years, we got together in the same school and we finished uh, the high school in that school. We had difficult times because we had to work and study at the same time. Like I said, sometimes he studied in the, in the morning, then in the afternoon, and uh, we changed schedules. Later in the years, we decided to, I mean, later in the years, we became adults. He decided to get married. I decided to go to the university. At the beginning, that was kind of uh, complicated for me because I had to do the same, the same thing, continue working and studying at the same time. Three, three years later, no, two years later, I was able to get my first job in a full English environment. Next, I became um, an English teacher and I got my first job at ITCA. Do you know what ITCA is and where is it located? Yeah, yeah yes. we know. Okay. Santa Tecla. Okay. Furthermore, I got a lot of experience there uh, in the teaching field. And then I decided to quit the job because I 
uh, started working in Centro Cultural. Okay. I started there. Teacher. Oh, do you study right there? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, but I, I remember that you was my my teacher on, on Centro Cultural. <laughs> <laughs> I remember you. <laughs> really? The world really? Is yours. Yeah. Really? <laughs> yes. What a history. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't I remember. I don't remember actually. Yes. I, I do uh one year, I think. Ah, okay. Yes. All right. Why you didn't tell me that before? Oh, because <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure. It was <laughs> nervous. You were not sure. Yes, yes. Ah, okay. <laughs> and you still working there, teacher? Yeah, I'm still working there and here. Hey. Yeah, here oh, too. That, mm -hmm. That's a good place. I studied there in 1990, 1992. 1992? All right. Yeah. Good. All right. That's great. And also, there are some groups from Insafor too. They have Insafor groups as well, online and, and on site too. Yeah. And tell us. Tell us what happened with your best friend. Ah, actually, uh, he decided to get married. He has three children, but he couldn't continue studying at the university. I finished the university. And thank God he has become, I mean, he has improved his life. He is so blessed. Even though he didn't go to the university, I'm so glad with him. I mean, for him. And uh, yeah, we improved our life and we continue. He got two children, actually. I don't have children yet, okay. but I am planning to. Okay. And yeah. he still be your best friend? He changed completely. Money, really? yeah, money change, <laughs> money changes minds. But really? for me, it, uh, I mean, it didn't change me at all. Uh, uh -huh. Okay. Sí, a veces la gente con el dinero cambia, pero a mí el dinero no me cambia. Yo siento que el dinero solo es para que lo disfrutes y compres cosas que no puedes comprar, ¿verdad? Cuando no tenés. Money y... going come. Exacto. Ahorita tenemos, mañana no tenemos. Pero la, a veces las personas cambian, cambian mucho. Ajá. Entonces, right. eh, quiero hacerte una pregunta. Tú estuviste en el grupo con Kelly, parece, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. La doctora. Correcto. Ah. Sí, más o menos me acuerdo. Ok. Sí, sí. Good, good. That's good. Ok, nice to see you again then. Nice to see you again, teacher. Vaya. Eh, si se fijaron, improvisé. Sí. Solo seguí como una secuencia de palabras. No es, no es necesario estas, eh, la sequence adverb, si sí es necesario que las usen en orden, ¿verdad? First, next, then, ok, and finally. Una secuencia lógica. Una secuencia lógica. Yo improvisé, obviamente. Y con la, gest, con la sequence words, tampoco es, es eh, un orden que tienen... Bueno, con la uh, sequence verbs sí hay que seguir un orden, pero con la sequence words no es necesario seguir un orden. Con uh -huh. solo que es lo que usted está diciendo tiene sentido, ¿ok? Según acorde a lo que usted va hablando, perfecto. Entonces, una historia de cuando usted era chico, un niño, puede hablar de su mejor amigo o alguna algo que le pasó, no sé, ¿verdad? Entonces, de esa forma lo vamos a hacer. Preguntas, antes de dejarlo ir, porque yo sé que tienen hambre. Tenemos que escribirlo y, y ya presentarlo mañana. Ajá. Para no olvidarlo hay que escribirlo. Sí, sería bueno es, ajá, escribir sus ideas para que sí, sí. todo lo que vayan diciendo tenga, tenga lógica. Tenga escribir lógica. sus okay. ideas y ya cuando ya tengan como su machote... Entonces lo vamos a presentar. Porque lo que quiero es que se desenvuelvan más con el speaking. Ok, good. Preguntas, dudas. 
No question. Ok. Y Carlos, por no decirme desde el principio del curso, él va a ser el primero. Ah, ok. Hasta la tercera semana, dice. Sí, no, qué barbaridad. Es que ya, qué bárbaro, Carlos. Perdón. Tenemos, tenemos que ir al centro cultural. Sí, y yo decía. Sí, ya me acordé. Sí. Esta cara es conocida. Ya me acordé. No, pero... Es que, es que, que, es que las vibras la vibra de él me parecían alguien conocido. Yo decía, ¿quién será? Pero me acordaba, no sé, sí, no. hacía como una similitud Ay. de alguien. Yo estuve estudiando ahí por un año, hice un año y meses, creo yo. Ah, ok. Sí, 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 sí me acuerdo okay. porque casi la mayoría de los cursos los hice con usted. Dice. Ah. Como, como ahí bueno. uno comienza y sigue en el mismo, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Ah, ya decía por qué, por qué es que hablas bastante bonito. Ah. <risa> Tampoco se echa tantas flores. <risa> okay. no, pero sí, aprendí mucho, la verdad. Sí. Eso me ha ayudado bastante. Sí, sí, sí. la verdad que sí tenés, tenés este buen nivel de inglés. Lo único que necesitas practicar es eh, más vocabulario y la fluidez. En Correcto. Vaya vale, chicos, no, los quito, no les quito más. Eh, okay. Buen provecho a los que no han cenado. And see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Have a good, good night. night. Good night, good everybody. Tomorrow. Good night. Good night to everybody.